Hi, gorgeous ghoulies. Today I have a Shein haul part three and maybe part four in this video. So it might go down to just three parts. I'm not sure yet. Depends on how quick I get through this first little bit. But if I decide either three or four, you'll know. You'll see it. I'll tell you in the last video that might not be the last video. Okay, I'm being silly now, but if you want to see what I got clothes-wise, stick around. All right, y'all, I've been recording today, trying to get some videos done so that if I have another downtime, another mental health issue, that I will have stuff already recorded so I can get posted and there won't be a steady flow. So now I'm doing part three of the Shein haul, which I said would be a four-parter. It might only be a three-parter, but if I keep talking like this, it will be a four-parter. And the sun has now started going down, so we're de defending, defending, depending on the box light. So, and in case y'all haven't noticed, new glasses. I love them. The only thing is right here though, they take my makeup off because my fat cheeks. When I talk or anything, it hits that. And so right there has no makeup. It's all on the glasses. But anyway, let's get into this. I have not pulled up my information yet because that's how I roll. Y'all know it by now. Let me pull up the information. I did have it already up on the screen, so it shouldn't take that long. I spit, I have problems. Do, 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 do. Oh, I guess I closed it. Why would I do that? Don't ask, we have no idea why I do the things I do. And if anybody's interested, the earrings I showed in a previous video for Bad Dahlia, so look it up. Or I need to put it in there, put it up here, over there, which I'll forget to do, so just saying. Let's see here. Why do they make it so difficult? All these damn things open. What we have here is, first we have, where are those at? I have other things that I have to show you. So yeah, this will be longer. I thought there was only two things, but there's more. Okay, what I have on right now is the Velvet Plus Velvet Not Cami. I paid $11.01. It was originally $13. It is a 3X, and it says that's an American 18, size 18. And then, after, when I back up, you will see, I purchased some jeans from there. So, those of you who wear jeans could kind of get a feel for how they they fit through the site and I always have trouble with their sizing on pants for some reason and evidently I'm still having trouble but I do still like the pants. So plus curvy high waist ripped skinny jeans $23. I bought a 2x a size 16. Now in American sizes I can wear a 14 or a 16 plus sizes. It just depends on how much stretch and if they're made for um a pear shape or an apple shape or whatever you know I just I have to try them on so I went safe and went with the 16 and I paid 1948 for them so these are the two items the 3x top 2x on the bottom let me put this down here all right the top is adorable let me lower my camera a little bit so I can back up here and show you how it it's like kind of like a baby doll type top or something it's just round it's exactly the same in the back as it is the front and you can adjust where it sits with these and i wanted it to cover see my bra showing a little bit i think yeah i wanted it to cover that it was really low before but just by adjusting these you can change how high or low it is so if you want it lower this i'm comfortable i like this right here it's literally just a tie that goes through I spit again. What is up with my teeth today? Making me spit. Sorry if you saw that. Oh my God. I'm a classy lady, y'all. So, anyway. 
it's it's nice. Is it stretchy velvet? Yes, stretchy, except for, of course, still got some stretch. But yes, it is very cute. I like it. It's comfortable. It's going to be so nice to still, I can still wear some velvet during the summer, but I'm not dying of a heat stroke. And I say that now because it's only, the AC said it's 70 or 68 right now, and I'm comfortable. So when it turns into 115 degrees outside, probably won't want it then, but then nothing's going to cool me off, so it doesn't really matter. Now, the jeans. When I pulled them out of the bag, they very much look like they were made for a pear shape. The waist looks, but the stretch was amazing. So I said, okay, we're going to put them on, and actually, look how loose they are. Very loose, and the one thing about high-waisted on me, the way my rolls work, that I pull them up where it's supposed to be, nice and high-waisted, nice, like it. Oh, and functioning pockets. That's another big one. Thank you, Shein, for giving us actual functioning pockets that aren't pulling either. Now, they are the skinny jeans, so they are loose on my ankles. Like I said, I probably could have done a 14 in these and been just fine. They are very stretchy, but they have a nice little bit of distressing, which I like. It's not crazy. It's not like all ripped up and shredded, which, okay, that's fine. It's just not what I wanted. I just wanted something kind of because they're my black. I wanted black and I wanted that. And the shoes, if you watch the video with the mixed haul, these are my Fashion Nova shoes. But yes, this outfit is so cute and so comfortable. I wore it for all the videos I've been doing and yeah, I'm really impressed. Button, zip, everything is just, it's re they're really a nice pair of jeans. I am very, very pleasantly surprised with my first experience. I kind of have been buying so many leggings that I've kind of been like, okay, well, those are always baggy. So I was like, please don't let them be too baggy. But then, you know, I was worried they would be too tight. I, I had no idea what to expect from the jeans. See, look how much room there is. So much stretch, so much. So I feel like I could go a couple of sizes, a couple of sizes bigger could get into this because there is so much room. I don't have a big butt, so all my, a lot of my weight is just carried right here in my big fat couch up here. There's nothing wrong with that. That is a descriptor. It is what it is, and you know what? So what? But yeah, cute outfit, love it, happy with it, can't complain. Now, the other things I purchased, and I'm still trying to figure out why I purchased this one. This is, Oh, iPad again. The plus plus cheetah print shawl 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 no shawl collar coat. It was on sale for eleven dollars and I paid nine thirty two. It is a two X size sixteen. Usually I order three X's on the top and even a four X if I want it to be oversized. But evidently the measurements were and see I have not even opened this up yet were such that I could get away with it. And I have no idea why I bought this. Oh, it kind of looks like a jacket, actually. Oh, and the fabric. Ugh. The fabric feels like the same that was on the pillow covers that I got. Not cool. Don't like that at all. Yeah. You see the pattern in the... I don't know. Can you see the lines in it? I don't know. It's not showing. There it goes. You can see them. It's that same fabric. It's like a fake velvet. It's not really velvet, the most, between suede and velvet, but it's fake. And my allergies today, it's super windy outside. My allergies are in overdrive. All right, y'all, here it is. This is why the shawl collar it's nice and wide lapels here. Ah, uh, no. Fake pockets. No pockets. These are completely fake. 
I feel like it's a cheap jacket from a, what do you call it, a costume store. Yeah, it's just not, once I felt the fabric, and that's why I was like, why did I order this? Maybe I saw somebody else with it and it looked really cute. I said, there's no lining or anything. It is cute print. I mean, I like it. I just think the quality is kind of, and see, this is a 2X, and look, it's very, still has the shoulders down here instead of up here. Very much room in this. Well, it's not bad. I think there could be more, and the fact that these are not pockets, it's distressing and disturbing, and I don't know why we can't have pockets and everything yet. It's 2021, give us pockets! But yeah, and maybe a, a button right here. I don't know how that would look. I have to look in the... Yeah, a little button. Maybe I'll add a button there, and that'll make it feel a little bit better. And then if I had the... One of those tops that are really thrifty up here that I bought from Shein... That might look good. I have wig hair everywhere. I'm literally covered in it. This is not my favorite wig. So, this, it's warm. Like I said, I get warm very easily, so I don't know. It's from the Shein Curve stuff. There is a seam right down the back as well, which, I don't know. I just feel like that makes it cheap also looking. It's not very professional in my opinion put that in the center when there's not actually any kind of different interest in the bottom. It could have been one piece panel. They could cut it on the fold and had that. I don't know, not my favorite. And I was wondering when I saw the package, I was like, why did I give this? And I'm not sure, I'm really not. There is a dart right there where the bust is, but yeah. Not my favorite. It feels very, like I said, once I put it on, it feels like, it looks like it's something from the costume shop. There's that. Onward. Or as I like to say, and we're walking. That is from some movie. Which movie is that from? Somebody please tell me because I cannot remember which movie it is from. That they're in a museum. Is Holland a psychic episode maybe? I feel like they're in a museum or somewhere and they're showing something and it goes, somebody says something there and we're walking and they go to the next thing. I don't know why that is in my head all the time. All right, three pairs of socks, which do I really need to tell you? Let me see, they're probably about the same price. Let me see. $2. Where's the others? $1.50 and $2 which I paid $1.28, $1.70. There we go on those. This is the pair that was $1.50. I am a sockaholic. Because even though I stay hot in the winter, I guess poor circulation, my feet are always freezing in my head. I don't know that it's for real, but it... <coughs> oh, excuse me. <coughs> so much talking that um it feels like they're cold these were the dollar fifty little dancing skeletons i don't know those feel very very tight mm, those might not fit very well just a basic sock this might be a little tight especially if you wash them i don't know anyway Nothing fancy, just dancing skeletons, so I can have my little spoopy socks on during the winter time. And since my skin is so dry as it is, also, I like to keep oil or lotion on my feet and keep socks on, and that helps with that dryness. The next pair, these were both, what did I say, $2 a piece? Let's see here. Missy, don't you dare pull that box down. I will lose my mind. These are just little skulls all over them. And these feel, yeah, these feel like they're a little more stretchy. Just a simple sock. I thought, hey, you know, for, what would I say, $1.54, $1.74 that I paid for them? Because I buy it 
Halloween time, the ones from the Dollar Tree for a dollar a piece, as long as they're spoopy. And this one here is my moons because I'm a moon child, as I say all the time. Now, these are another pair that, that ribbing in it feels, and another thing that's odd, where they've done the image itself, there goes Missy, see her? She's going to get into something. I don't know if you can see. See the ribbing? And then where the image is, it changes. It's not ribbed. It's like the bottom. Yeah. It's really weird that it changes like that. It's very obvious, too. There's a rib, and then it stops. Yeah, it's like that on both sides. Just off. And here's the final piece from this part of the haul. Yeah, I'm going to go ahead. Because I'm trying to keep these under a certain amount of time. All right, another pair of slippers. Oh yeah, okay. Go Dana, more slippers. These are adorable. I gotta fluff them up though. They've been in that bag. I tried them on, they are so cute. Again, oh, getting too old for this. All right, here's I got the medium, which they say a medium on here. I think it's 38, 39, which is what a seven, seven and a half. I wear a size seven and I usually can buy a medium. So that's what I went with. They come in different colors and let me see how much these were. Let's see here. Fluffy Bow Decor Bedroom Slipper, $17. I paid $14.24, so it's Walmart prices. And I like to have the bottom here because I can still go out and like get the dog or something if it's wet on the ground. Not in the mud, but at least out there on the back porch. So I'm going to throw these on and see if y'all can see them. I can see the other ones. So. Let's see here. And they fit. Oh, yeah. Oh, they're adorable. Let me go to ground. All right. Yeah. There they are. <sighs> My nose. Sinuses. Oh, they are so cute. I like them. They're so cute. And I don't remember what other colors they had. I can check just real quick and show you all. Fluffy, fluffy. They are super fluffy. And the inside is also faux fur. Faux fur. Fur fur? Faux fur? Yes. So, with a gray bow. Yeah, these are adorable. So, let me see what other colors they came in. So I can tell y'all. Let me see, get up there and lay down. Oh, look at you. You want to be on my fluffy blanket, didn't you? These also come in, oh, okay, it wasn't in this listing, but there are other colors. I'm pretty sure they had, you know, the pinks, the blues, grays. Might have gray with a black bow, I'm not sure. But that's it for this part, for part three. The next part, part four, is three dresses, I believe. They're dresses, and I'm going to be burning up, so... Yeah, I'm not going to, because they're long sleeve. And I want to get them done before the season gets any more hot outside. So, they're one of them in so witchy. The other two I call my witchy prairie dresses. But anyway, so I hope everybody is doing well. I'm sorry, I'm, I need to go take some allergy medicine. The wind, everything this time of year. It said the tree pollen was at its highest today, so, and air quality was not great so it's one of those days but it is what it is so just remember everybody you know what i say all the time you're beautiful just the way you are and don't let anyone take away your shine ever ain't worth it i'll see y'all next time bye